Hey guys and gals, this is Matt, Matt who just some guy from the internet, and welcome to my new playthrough of Dynamite Heady, one of my favorite games on the Sega Genesis. Actually, let's make it clear, it is my favorite game on the Sega Genesis. It beats Sonic, it beats uh, Rocket Knight Adventures, it just, it's, it's filled with charm, and I love every minute of it, and I want to show it to you guys. If you guys never play this game, please do, do yourself a favor. And let's watch this opening cinematic here. Cast of puppets. So if it isn't obvious, it is a puppet show. So we're constantly on a giant set. And our main star is Hetty. Head case. These are the puppets that of course appear on the game. Hangman, you'll see them all come to play later on. <laughs> Look at that guy. <laughs> These are giant toy collecting machines. I. They're just giant robots that collect puppets, or townsfolk, whatever you want to call it. There's a game that recently came out that's very reminiscent to this called The Puppeteer on the PS3. If you haven't played it, check it out. Really loved it. There's our hero. What are you doing to Dynamite Hetty? If you look at the top there, those screens, every character is actually a big boss that comes to play later on. They're called the Key Masters. Just throwing that out there. And she passes. She's good. Welcome to DD Imperial World. <laughs> oh, what's going to happen with Dynamite Eddie? Nope. To the incinerator with you. <laughs> Heather, she comes to play as well. And get out of there. <laughs> Look at the soldier's face. Oh, no. And the getaway. Look how this game starts off with a bang. Giant missiles being thrown at you. Don't worry, they won't hurt you at all. It's just for the show. Now, check this guy out right here. One of the giant robots. You can actually kill this guy by just spamming your attack. You don't have to, but if you do, you get a secret bonus point. They're useless I guess they're just secrets and they're kind of cool and fun to look for and find throughout levels so just keep giving this robot head <laughs> see what I did there yeah a lot of puns are gonna be coming to play we got a secret bonus point be free my fellow companions I love how there's like advertisements all over the stage Sega <laughs> Eddie the superstar just dodge this plane right here very easy Buy your little balls at you. Haha, <laughs> you suck. For some reason, I always pictured Dynamite Eddy as, you know, this sarcastic New Yorker or some, some, some sort. And, uh oh. There in the background is Trouble Bruin. Yeah, pun intended. He comes into play a lot throughout this adventure. He is basically Dark Demon, which is the main antagonist's right hand man. Love how there's actual, like, people dragging the background because it's so heavy. <laughs> and in, by the way, in the Japanese version, Trouble Bruin's purple. Just throwing it out there. Hit him in the face. After that attack. I will absorb all the power and I will destroy you. Yeah, your Dragon Ball crap ain't gonna work on me, pal. You just gotta hit him twice and you'll knock this guy right off the stage. Ooh. For some reason, Trouble Bruin sounds like a girl, but it's actually a guy. I remember the instructions booklet. And we got one out of one secret bonus points. Again, they just give you points, if you care about points. I don't. But if you do, well, collect them all. I will not be showing them all in the walkthrough, because I don't know where they all are, but I'll show you the ones I know. And a lot of them just come into play randomly, like, with specific bosses and stuff. I'll, I'll show you later on. <laughs> Look at this guy here. He's having a mental breakdown. <laughs> Wanna see my socks? Nope. I like the guy on top of the sign. What are you gonna do? Look at him. Uh, what are you gonna do? This woman's just crying. There's ducks. This guy's taking a shot in the background. There's this guy wobbling around like a moron. This game is wacky. And I love it. There's a little tutorial. Meet Headcase. 
Hello, Hetty, I'm Headcase. Hit me to change your head. Practice now to see what sort of heads you have. So, hit Headcase, you hit the hammer sign, you get a hammer power up. Pretty sweet, right? Here you go, fire power. That's what I love about this game. And by the way, the heads do not last for that long. Eventually, they will go away. But, uh, oh, if you don't like the head you got, you just can press the A button and you'll reject the head. So you can keep switching like that. Oops. So you want to kill all the guys here. Look at this one. Looks like a pig of some sorts or a hippo. You got to kill all these guys, all 24 of them. We're going to keep this head. This is like, I don't know, spitting stars at you. I really, this was my favorite head. This head always saved me from bosses and stuff because you can do a lot of damage. You can hit guys, keeps enemies away. I kind of want the, the vacuum for this part because it just sucks them all up and you never get hit. And if you accomplish these secret uh, tutorials, you get, well, you'll see. Congratulations! You've just got a secret bonus point. Don't lose your head, Eddie. I like the band playing. <laughs> Back to the practice area. What is that thing? It's like a duck. Uh, meet Hangman. Hello, Hetty. I'm Hangman. Grab me and then let go to move things around. Practice now to see how I can help you move. So, just attach your head to Hangman and it'll throw you up. Right up there. Just shoots you up in the air. By the way, if you fall to the bottom of the screen like that, you won't die. You'll just be thrown back up, but you will lose HP. And if you actually lose all your HP, you'll be thrown out of the tutorial level, and you won't get the secret bonus point. Not that it matters. You really don't actually have to do these tutorials, by the way. I'm just showing them off because I really love this game, and I want to show as much off as I can. I like how there's just buckets left behind by the crew. They don't care. They don't even bother taking it out. Hurry up! Okay, I'll do my best. Let's keep going up, guys. Level 4. It's really not that bad at all. Really not hard. Okay, I kind of shot myself up there really fast. Eventually, we'll reach the sky. Well, space it, rather. I wish you could knock these buckets down. It'd be funny. I love how the hangmen are so happy. Look at them. <laughs> They're having the time of their life. Kind of weird. Look at this right here. You want to hit one, then jump to hit the other. And I think we're up there. Are we there? We're reaching We're reaching space, guys. We're reaching space. Ouch. Doesn't matter if you get... Doesn't matter if that happens, because look. By the way, the spotlight on the left is uh, your health. So you want to keep that in mind. And you just want to jump on this platform, and we've accomplished this tutorial. Hello, the doves. Congratulations! You've just got a secret bonus point. I'll catch you later, Hetty. And? <laughs> oh, God. I've lost my marbles! You wanna smell my socks? No, I don't. I, I told you already. Me, Bo. Hello, Hetty. I'm Bo. Watch me to see where Keymaster's weak spots are. Practice now to see how I can help you attack. So let's just follow Bo here. Bo, by the way, in French means, uh, like, beautiful or handsome, I guess. I'm not French. Well, I'm kind of French. Maybe I'm French. I'm not telling you. Welcome to my playthrough where I teach you French. Bonjour, comment ça va? Means, hi, how are you? So you can go flaunt that at school. Or work. Or wherever you want to flaunt it. So just keep hitting this, and eventually what's going to happen is... The little guys in these capsules are going to change colors. And eventually, after killing them enough times, they'll just stop coming. they stop spawning, rather. And you have a time uh, up there, so you want to do this through the time loop. Sorry. Trying to get all of these guys. There's just so many, Bo. You're driving me crazy. There we go. I think when they're green, or gray, or rather is when you know you've lo you hit the last one. This is b b b b bananas Oh, there's just this guy left. Come on, Bo. Keep giving me this guy. Keep giving me this guy. There we go. Ooh, congratulations! <laughs> Look at Dynamite. 
Congratulations, you got a secret bonus point. So, you get the point, Henny. Oh, boy. Get out of here. I think Bo is a guy or a girl. I'm not sure. We'll just call it an it. Sorry, lady. We'll take care of this. Let's go to danger. Toys in the hood. Dynamite Henny now on sale. I love that. So, let me show you something kind of funny. I really like this. I don't know why. I'll show you it right here. See this guy with the sword? You can knock him off. Watch. Aw! Oh, shoot! Well, there's more guys. I'll show you after. You can knock them off when they're deflecting. Let me show you another secret bonus point. Because why not? Take the hammer power up and knock this guy off. Watch. Nice. Look at the background. Those guys taking a shower in the... Uh, Ari's dance. No, he's not taking a shower. He's dancing. I always thought he was taking a shower for some reason. Because that's how I take my shower. Like that guy in the background. Hit him when he opens his mask. Oh, I think there's actually a guy here we could do it. I really love this. Please, let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. <laughs> I love that. Hi. What up? That's what Dynamite Heidi says. Oh, by the way, you see the head case here? When there's the B icon, if you click on it, it'll take you to a bonus stage. And I'm not doing bonus stages. But if you do the bonus stage, and you do it properly, by meaning you actually succeed in it, you get a number. And if you gather all those numbers throughout the playthrough, at the end of the very game when you... Ah, forget it. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. I really don't know what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> Basically, you gather all the numbers, and you get a, a secret ending of sorts. I'm not going to do it because I really hate bonuses in games. This guy is wacky. Look at him with his eyes. His crazy eyes. So just keep hitting him. And eventually when he goes in the other... Oh, I killed him. He's dead. Kill these puppets here. We got two secret bonus points. This is miniature heady, but we're actually going to... Well, I'm going to show you another secret bonus point. Hit the spikes here and you can climb walls. Cool, right? And we face another boss. Hit his scales. Knock him right off. There you go. Really not that hard. Because I don't think you could hurt him yet. Yeah, knock them all off. Hit this here. You can freeze time with it. Pretty awesome head. And then just keep hitting him. By the way, if he's about to fire at you like that, you can't hurt him. So, just something to keep in mind. I like using the time thing. Oh, oops, I got the three heads. I, want, I don't want that one. I want this one. Oh, I want the other one. Oh, he's dead. And we got a secret bonus point. Do, 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 do. Let's go. Mad Dog and Hetty. I love this. Check this out. <laughs> I love this part. Whoa. And there's the first key master, Mad Dog. And there's Bo. Target. <laughs> I love that. Just gets knocked off. All right, so obviously the target is his tail. By the way, the music, does it sound familiar? I'll give you a hint. Nutcracker. Yes, it is the Nutcracker theme. By the way, I just noticed something right now, and I've played this game so many times. If you look at the background, check the windows. There's a face in one of them. And it's just looking at me creepily like, Hi, pal. How are you doing? Oh, you're just fighting a big dog? That's cool. <laughs> So just keep hitting his tail. As you can see, it's getting red, which means he's about to die. By the way, uh, oh god, this head. You cannot lose this head. And if you have it, look at him. Help me! You can't. You just have to wait until it goes away. Another thing I was gonna say. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna die. No, 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 no. Uh, what I was gonna say is the dog sometimes will drop a character that is actually a secret bonus point. Gather all these little tokens here, and you'll get a continue if you get enough of them. Oh, I didn't get enough of them. That sucks. Oh, and I was missing one secret bonus point, which is what I was telling you earlier about the dog dropping this little white guy. It's like this little white guy with two little pom-poms in his head. He really looks weird. And every time you kill him, you get a secret bonus point. He shows up on and off throughout. Mostly the bosses, actually, to be honest with you. I'll show you him later, because there's a specific point where you'll spawn no matter what. 
And? Yes. Yas. That's Heather. You welcome. I like how she's British. And I like how she goes cross-eyed when she gives you a kiss. She's like, bah. <laughs> Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, guys. That'll be that for this part. Next time, we'll go down under and face the evil key masters. <laughs>